Greetings viewers, it's Kenji and I, as we're back again with another Fight Night Champion. Um, this was just like, this This was on a previous episode, this whole ESPN thing. Basically telling about how like good we've been doing and everything and all that good stuff, so. Good evening, everybody. This is not the next Joe fight against Alvarez. Welcoming you to the Aragon Ballroom um, here in Chicago, guy's name. Illinois. For a much on this one, he buys the judges, so I gotta knock him out. Ricardo Alvarez is an established That is a very contender. difficult thing to do. Andre Bishop is a hot rising prospect. Will Bishop shine in the spotlight? I don't know if I can knock Larry this guy out. Done throughout that. his career from the amateurs to this moment now have prepared him for this moment. I bet he's gonna knock him out or else we lose because the judges now he's have been bought. This is Alvarez's hometown in Texas, Locks away I guess. that headshot. When you have a lot of Come speed, on, baby. how effective can a feint be? Oh boy, it could be really effective because your opponent is keyed up already. Before the bell even rings, he's jumping out of his shoes. He's waiting for something to come quick. So you let him think it's coming, he's gonna react to it. I'm just gonna freaking you go get him. Wow, well, just like the punches. old timers, a four punch combination. Nice block. I'm gonna suffocate him with freaking punches to the face. Nice work to the midsection with the left. And Go oh, ahead, what a come good, strong uppercut by okay, Andre on, Bishop. Me, Halfway through this round here. <laughs> wow, what an uppercut. All he's doing is going to the body every single time. Just freaking try to get me to tie out. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna let him this time. The other day when we were talking to Andre Bishop, he said to have hey, success in this punches. fight, I have body to punches. land combinations. He landed a good one there. He covers up nicely, gets rid of his opponent's body shot. Andre Bishop's right hand scores well. Hey, that, that body time. punch, though. Tremendous. Ridiculous. Pace being set early on here between these two. Can't see this fight going the distance with this pace. No, not unless something changes, like moving their heads a little bit. Final 10 seconds of round number one. Nice work, the left hand to the head. Bishop's not just loading up, he's landing Damn combination it. punches. Three minutes gone by. Kick. The judges ain't even watching this fight. I can see it in their eyes. McQueen. That's him, McQueen. Us. Fuck that guy. We're not winning any decisions tonight. Means you gotta knock this guy on the canvas. Understand? Knock him on his ass. Got you, coach. You gain it, coach. All right. Here we go. Round two is underway. I can knock him out. This music is just like. Off the yap. That's okay. Feel that. It's like perfect. You know what I mean? Like, oh my goodness. Ooh, there's one good hook. He's going. He going bye bye. Oh! We're seeing every angle that Andre Bishop offers up. He's a smart fighter and can counter beautifully. Good Ooh. head shot by Andre Bishop. That's a damaging blow. Halfway through this round, sharp three on, punches baby. landing by Andre Bishop. Ooh. Nothing's happening, you know? Like. Goes up top with That's the right a haymaker hand. right there, man. Scored well up top. Zones in on that overhand uh -oh. right. Back up, back up. Yes. And now another left. A headshot blocked. Combos. There it is. Them haymakers are just not Fine doing work it. With the left hand, he landed well by Andre Bishop. Look at that. That's all I got. It's just not going down. Uh oh, bad. That's bad. I'm gonna see if I can time it. Move your head. Oh boy, that worked idea. out well with the uppercut. Comes right back at him with the left hand. 
Oh my god, I don't know how we're gonna do and this. And that's the end of round two. The center of the ring, okay? Let's see if we can do this. Back underway here, oh. the live fight action. Tough fight to score. Very, very even, closely contested bout throughout. Well, I don't know if he's hip to the idea of becoming a counterpuncher, but I get the sense you'd agree with it. Yeah, definitely. I mean, he's got the perfect oh platform, my God. the perfect form for it. The guy's walking in right now, not moving his right head now. much. Stay away from so he can focus. time him, he can counter him. I gotta knock him the fuck out, but it's, it's just so... It just keeps coming. With the right. I'm hitting him with everything I got. Is this possible? Is it possible? Good yeah. left there. Good work. He said oh. he was going to do it from the outside, and now he has. He just got to his man. Why well, get off his me. opponent had no that idea that he was still in range. Oh, yeah, he let's go. By a left hand. Go down. That he had go no down. On. Go down. He was stunned. Now he's in control. Momentum Bitch. so critical. And that's the thing about this boxing game. One second you're in control, the next second you're not. See that? He just, he just doesn't go down. Circle it! Move! Move! Ridiculous. Right there, and I'm about, and to, I'm about to get knocked out. Watch. Knocked. Now he gets his man. Look at that, wow. man. Jesus. Oh, this is going to be close. This game cheats. He may be able to survive the round, but he has gone down This game down cheats, now. man. Three. Fucking cheats. How many times did I punch what him when he was stunned? now with Andre Bishop as he rises up to fight on after being four. Oh! Look at that. Andre Bishop punches? rocked really? by that power punch. Bishop Whoa. is down. So dumb. We're gonna prevail, man. I hate that. Oh, I hate Gus Polisi has always been pushing Andre Bishop throughout his whole career. Now he's got to push a little harder. He was on the floor in that last round. Well, one thing that I know that Gus won't say, a lot of inexperienced trainers will say, are you all right? Gus will say, you're fine. You've been through this before. He will reassure him in that way, and then he will send them back out. I'm, I'm slower now. It's hurt. Not I need, I need this round well at all. to recuperate. Takes one to give one. He comes back with a right hand. Bishop's landed a good, solid combination. Come on. I gotta pick my punches now. This is why so many feel Andre Bishop has such a bright future. Look at the countering ability against Ricardo Alvarez. Good left hand able to land. Bishop's combination punching is working well here. 90 seconds to go in round number four. A hammering hook to the head by Andre Bishop. And you can see he wanted to do that as he holds on there. Little head knocking with that right hand. This is not a good sign for Andre Bishop. It appears that he's slowing at this point. Yeah, what he needs to do is start placing his shots a little bit. But right now, as you just alluded to, he's just not throwing. Bishop's fighting real smart here on the outside. I don't know. <laughs> Nothing I do affects him. Locks that punch. Body shot. Andre Bishop's putting his punches together now. That's round, a guys. nice combination. I don't know. Well, I Bishop can rounds. string together a few rounds like that. This is going to be a very easy fight for him. Well, he looks like a confident fighter. All that amateur background is really showing. Solid counter punch by Andre Bishop. I'm going to get him with that straight, maybe. Maybe the hook is just not working. Maybe that straight right there will work. And he returns on that exchange. Yeah, with the jab, straight jabs. 
Bishop slugging style is really paying off here, Teddy. We're in the middle rounds of these fights, and it's clear to me who's controlling this. Yeah, well, the reason it's clear to you is he's got out. to fight in the quarters, in the dimensions he wants it, in nice and tight. I like how Bishop is fighting smart right here, really countering effectively. Takes one to give one. Uppercut in return. Ooh. Shake it off. Boy, sharp two-punch combination by Andre Bishop. There it is. Teddy, I think he's going to go down. I think he's going to go down after getting tagged right there. He doesn't know. There, there it, it is. is, guys. That was Finally. a big shot that floored him, and it's a big shot that may end him right here. Oh, that looked like goodness. the great pitch of great that was Maddox. Tough. His sinker ball. That Boy, was it tough. went down quick. Oh, my God. I got knocked down twice. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't really talk that much. I was just focused on the game. Ridiculous. Yeah. Oh. 11 and 0. We were ready to make a move. My future looked bright. Yeah, baby. There we go, people. Woo. Now you're about nice to see place. this place. Gym's closed, fellas. We didn't come here to work out. What's going on? We came to have a little talk. Look at that body punches. Those motherfuckers. I man. thought they were McQueen's thugs, but they were cops. Dirty cops on McQueen's payroll. Wrong fucking move, kid. Wrong fucking move. Good evening, everyone. I'm Brian Kenny, and welcome to Friday Night Fights here on ESPN. Before we get into tonight's oh action, God. some shocking news this week involving middleweight prospect and amateur gold medalist Andre Bishop. Reports are coming in that Bishop has been arrested for allegedly carrying an unlicensed firearm and assaulting two police officers. Details remain spotty, but the word is there was an altercation in the late hours of the evening between Bishop and the police at Carisi's Boxing Club, the gym where Bishop trains. The word of two decorated police officers was all it took. Now you know what happened. My dreams. <laughs> so I got fucked freedom. up in the bathroom. Everything was taken from me. Everybody up! Cell block D! This is how yeah. this happened, yes. Now you know. We got fucked up. Nobody could help me. I had to help myself. I couldn't let this place beat me. I did what I had to do. I fought. Look how big he got, man. That's prison, prison muscles right there. That's prison muscles. Those crackers been talking so much about kicking your ass. They think they can take you one on one. I had to agree to some conditions, though. Bare knuckles. No refs, no rounds. I'm fighting till somebody quits. Or can't get up. Ooh. I like those conditions. We're about to get freaking... We're about to Let's get down on some prison rules. About to get down some prison rules. Look at this white boy. Look at Remember now, that professional boxing shit ain't gonna help you here. You got to knock this motherfucker out. Oh, we're finna knock him out, coach. <laughs> Alright, guys. Well, that's it for this episode. Till next time, you know what's about to go down. It's about to, we're about to brawl up some, some prison in prison rules. We're about to freaking knock these people out. And let's see if we can get out of jail, huh? All right, until next time, see ya.